Good morning from Castaway Key. We are very excited. We have a huge, busy, busy day ahead of us. Filled with lots of adventures. Mm -hmm. And awesome things. There'll be fish involved, some flying, lots of water. It'll be fun. Yeah. On the road again. We just cannot wait to get on the road again. I think I'm just saying whoa when all of your videos are just fine. I like it. husband just fetching me the bright yellow bike because that's the one I think is cutest. Okay guys, we have our bikes. I am all GoPro'd up. I feel very like sporty right now. I'm like, yeah, let's do this GoPro. I'm so excited. So the trails are gonna be awesome and beautiful and I cannot wait to see what we get out of this. Mm -hmm. I feel very adventurous. It's gonna be exciting. Yes. Woo -hoo. Yes. Okay, let's do this. to the top of the observation deck. Yeah, we did. We can see the entire island from up here and it is amazing and see other islands from up here and the water is like, look at that color guys. Like it's so beautiful and blue and it's amazing. And this biking was super fun. It's very nice. Yeah. Uh, it's not even like a workout. It was like really nice breeze. Yes. Just open road. The weather's incredible. We're like a bike gang now. Basically, mm -hmm. basically. Okay, so we are, we just stopped to take some fabulous pictures on this amazing road. And um, yeah, the next part is to get back on our bikes. We're gonna return our bikes and then we're going to hit up that ocean. Oh, hey, just hanging out in my goggles. We are about to go scuba diving. Um, no, snorkeling. I keep saying scuba diving, I shouldn't say that. We're going about to go snorkeling. <laughs> Gavin has give, taught us the ropes, so. I'm not good at teaching the ropes, so hopefully well, we won't drown. Or they won't drown, I'll be fine. I feel like. <laughs> It's Disney, so we can probably just stand up and we'll be fine. Mm. We're just gonna stand up and be fine. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. It's, it's gonna be great. great. Your first time snorkeling is gonna be fantastic. It's, and it's gonna be awesome. And it's gonna be caught on the GoPro. Yeah. Because Gavin has the stick. I've got my little GoPro. selfie stick, so it'll be fun. I'm just glad I get to use my GoPro and like <laughs> play and explore and learn. And be adventurous. Like it's GoPro gonna be so much fun. people do. We gotta find the hidden Mickey. It's gonna be oh, great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They said there's like all kinds of stuff. And in case you guys are wondering, like I was wondering, and I no one actually I watched a lot of videos about this um, castaway key and no one really said it, but the cast members confirmed that there are predator nets all around the <laughs> the snorkeling area. So what a predator net is, it means that there's gonna be no sharks, barracudas, or anything that will kill you in there. Mm. Except for maybe Gavin. <laughs> da dum da dum da dum da da. I'm just kidding, I won't bite you. <laughs> I feel like I don't want to get sunscreen in my mouth. Oh, no, I, I have a lot of sunscreen on. Um, so yeah, there are predator nets around the whole area, so if you guys are worried about that kind of stuff, there's nothing to be worried about. This is my first time, I am scared, but husband is here, Gavin is here, Gavin's done this before, and we are in a very controlled Disney environment. So, um, if all goes well, I'm inserting snorkeling footage here, and if it doesn't, I'll be back in five seconds to cry on camera and tell you guys how scared I was. <laughs> a fish? Okay, good, I got him on camera, and I got you on camera. I survived. It was actually a lot of fun. Um, 
I mean, I talked to you guys and told you guys how scared I was about doing it and how this was like totally me facing one of my biggest fears, which is like being out in open water. And granted, it was in open water, it was very like contained, but it was still in, like out there enough to normally make me freak out. And Gavin was very patient, and husband was very patient and encouraging. And I almost bailed about three times at the beginning, and then. I think by the time I got out there, there was just so much to see and like all these fish and stuff and it was amazing um, that I just calmed down and I just did it. Um, it's kind of the theme of this trip is like face your fears, Crystal. Nothing to be afraid of and I was kind of thinking about it as I was getting lunch about how, you know, as plus size women we feel like, you know, there's something wrong with us and we're scared to be out of our houses and we're scared to be judged and we're scared of all this stuff. And you know what? I was scared today, and I did it, and it was awesome. And I wouldn't have had this amazing experience with my husband and my best friend if I had been if I had been scared and I just didn't do it. You know what I mean? So, moral of the story: just do it. Don't be scared. Stop being scared. And as the Face Your Fears tours of the Bahamas continues, we're having a quick lunch, and then we are going parasailing. So, just want to show you guys we're having for lunch. Um, Thunder Mountain style barbecue. If you guys have been to the California parks. You know, Big Thunder Ranch is closed now, but if you want a taste of it, you can definitely get it here at Castaway Key. So I have lots of meat, and husband has ribs and beans, and Gavin. I had potato salad mm -hmm. that was really good, and it had on the side the tomatoes and onions that you have. And I had a couple of ribs that everybody has, they're really good, and I got a cheeseburger. That looks really good too. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah. Okay, Gavin has left us to go back to the ship to relax and do her hair and stuff, get ready for tonight. We are going parasailing. I'm like slightly tired from like all of the, of the snorkeling, but I'm sure this will wake me up real fast. <laughs> That was awesome. I actually ended up going twice because there was a girl there and she didn't have her family with her and she was too light, I think, to go by herself. So she was kind of asking around if anyone would go with her and as much as I was terrified and as much as I kind of wasn't sure if I wanted to, I felt bad for her because she was young and so I went again and it was better the second time but now I feel like kind of a little seasick because it's a lot to bear sail twice in a row but my god like I feel like I won today you know like when you have those days where you're just like doing all these things that you never thought you'd do and like facing your like very real very legitimate fears of like open waters height boats like everything like I just faced it all today and I really really feel like I won um what an incredible day I can't, I just, I'm kind of in awe like you know we talk so much about living fearlessly and living your best life and doing just living living yolo right and i did like a bunch of stuff today that just scares the actual crap out of me um feeling super proud of myself right now actually it's kind of awesome um okay guys so i'm gonna go get ready for dinner take a little nap sort out this hair and um i'll see you guys at paula tonight for dinner
Okay guys, my second course is a white bean Tuscan soup. It looks beautiful, we have pancetta and kale. I forgot to vlog the um, appetizer. We did do a little charcuterie with some prosciutto. There was some fresh parmesan, artichokes, um, peppers, olives. And then Gavin's um, second course is caprese with beefsteak tomatoes and a beautiful arugula salad. Looks amazing. And it's buffalo mozzarella, by the way, you guys. And then husband has a little gnocchi. Okay, guys, main courses are here. Husband has the, is it beef tenderloin, babe? Mm -hmm. Beef tenderloin, that looks gorgeous. And then I have the butternut agnolotini, which is effectively kind of like a butternut um, ravioli, which is beautiful. And we have the beautiful lamb.